And I remember my father was sent away to a pushovok farther away with my brother, and I was with my mother there. And I worked on the fields. My mother didn't. She didn't work. But I worked every in the morning. I would come to that area, and they would send us on the fields. And that's when I had this with the, with the boo. See, one day, see, we would come to that like an office in, with wagons because the fields were kilometers away. They weren't right there. So we, and they used their oxen, mostly oxen. It would be a wagon with two oxen or one oxen and a guy with a, what is it called, that you heard, a whip, with a whip, and he would take us to the fields to work. One day, this guy from our wagon didn't show up. So the Nachalnik, the overseer, gives it to me. Here, you're going to be the Voschik. That means Voschik. But I figured if he could do it, I could do it. So he told me two words, Tzop, Tzebe. I don't remember if Tzop is right and Tzebe left or the other way around. But I knew at the time. At the time, I knew which was right and which was left. So he says, you want them to go right, say Tzop, you want to go left, Tzebe, and kind of hit them a little on the side. And I figured, oh, good. Ah. And here I get all these women. They weren't old women, but they were middle-aged women that were working. And I guess I was the youngest, so he figured, you go ahead. And we're traveling, and the top the best are listening to me, what I tell them. And, I've, and I got so secure to myself that I'm doing it so good. And when we passing by, there is this one bull, you know, eating grass. It was already by near the fields where we were supposed to be working. I didn't know that at the time the difference between an ox and a bull. They were bulls, and he was a bull. He was there, and when I was passing by, I kind of hit him with my... <gasps> He started chasing us, and my two oxen started running. And they were scared to death, and everybody's screaming, and I'm screaming, I can't stop him, and I don't want to stop him, because he's chasing us. And we ran into a ravine, and the wagon got turned over, and the oxen couldn't go any farther. So they stopped, and the wagon was turned over. We got off the wagon, and we ran into bushes, and we hid, and this wool came, and the soil there was, was plowed, but nothing was yet. It was picked, in other words, but nothing was seeded yet. So he started kicking the soil. It must have been flying 20 feet into the air. He was so mad. But then he kicked up, and we were hiding. He kicked everything up. Then he got up and went away. So we went out, but we couldn't over us. We couldn't turn that wagon over. Straighten it out. And so it's one of the women went on the fields where she found a couple of old men and they came, and with us, we straightened out that wagon. And that was my, you know, how I found out what's the difference between a bull and an axe.